99 Queen Street West, here's George Lugget Dennis and Monica the Old. Hello everybody and welcome to the Electric Circus. Hi Monica. You took the words right out of my mouth, you know? That was a taste of the legendary Electric Circus dance show that so many of us grew up with and remember as part of the heyday of City TV and much music. Well, 35 years later, EC is being fondly remembered and celebrated with a special anniversary party here at Lavelle in downtown Toronto featuring several familiar faces, including the man himself, Zoomer Media President. The legend, the icon, the executive producer of everything at City TV and much music, Moses Snyder! Those of you who know me know that my favorite word in the English language is next. So I don't spend a lot of time in introspection and don't live much in the past. So I'm chuffed and tickled pink. And, uh, and thrilled to see the incomparable Monica Diol take command of the room and run the show and tell me what to do. <laughs> We'd pay tribute uh, to the show, those who appeared on it, those who watched it, and of course its creator, Moses Neimer, uh, who presided not only over much music, but all of 299 Queen Street West. None of the successes at City TV, much music, or anywhere else would have happened without this mind. This is a man who had a vision for the future of local television, and he explained it and showed it to the world and demonstrated how it could be done. And congratulations to you, Moses. Man. Electric Circus was a community. A lot of people from all over the city, all over this country, all over the world participated in the show and really made it what it was. It was a family. This show changed television, changed me, it gave me a career, and uh, I'll be forever grateful to Moses for that. My name is Peter, a.k.a. the Eurodance guy. I love Euro. I watched Electric Circus all throughout the 90s. It was my Saturday thing. I am one of the original dancers of Electric Circus, a regular. Right? You still got the moves? Oh, I still got the moves. But you are the heart and the spirit of Toronto in many, many ways. The proceeds from this event will go to Cam Age, Toronto Center for Addiction and Mental Health, a charity that was chosen because of its feeling of inclusivity, a safe place for all, very much like the diverse crowd that shared the dance floor and tuned into the electric circus right across the country. A special connection that, as you can see, continues to this day. Here in Toronto, I'm Darren Maharaj for Zoomer News.